Hello everybody, and welcome back to the Hunt of Call of the Wild. We haven't played this in quite a while. Uh, in fact, we haven't played this in so long that I don't have my little uh, PNG tube set up. Um, which is quite something. If I was clever enough to remember how to set up studio mode, then uh, I could go and grab it without you ever needing to notice, but I'm not, so. You're going to have to, to witness me going and grabbing it. There we go. Little, little PNG Dizzy is here with us. We are going to be jumping into Hirschfelden. Uh, and picking up wherever it was that we left off on this, which, to tell you the truth, I don't really recall. Hurricane's volume could be higher. Oh, that's just, um... Yeah, that looks like it's fairly good. Oh, actually, that's going to be a lot louder when you guys, when I when I get the caller out, isn't it? There we go. Okay, doke. Um, what time is it? It is five oh five. So we are just getting into morning time now. I have exactly zero idea where we are, but first things first, as always, is fix your kit. So what have I got on me? I've got my Magnum. Seven mil rounds that take four to nine. Got my Ranger, two, four, three rounds that do two to six. And I've got arrows for everything else. I probably want to sort out my quarters. What have we got? This doesn't help us here. Uh, that doesn't help us here. I was uh, doing some some night hunting on Layton, so I've got my Layton set up on the moment. Uh, don't need you either. There's uh, Puma, Lion, Grey will probably be able to you. That will grab us the fox and we can keep you. Fallow deer. Don't have access to deer. Don't have you. What deer do we have here on her shoulder? <laughs> um, can anyone remember? There's a little deer. Uh, I'm gonna have to Google it because I'm, I'm too dense, unfortunately. Uh, huntable animals. What's a little deer called? It's called a roe deer. There we go. That's what a little deer is. Uh, we don't have a call of that, I'm pretty sure. Moose. Don't care. That one already tried that. Don't have you. Red deer we have. Oh, we do have a roe deer caller. There we go. And the goose. Not after you, apparently. Uh, we have pigs here, right? Yeah, we have pigs here. Um, turkey, don't care about oh, roadie ascent, not so fast by. Now oh, we've got our binoculars on. How much does this weigh? We could actually fit that on, but I never ever ever use it, so there's not really very much point. Okay. Um, that's our inventory set up. Uh, I hate, I hate that it defaults to the, 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 hot, the wheel. Instead of the hotkeys. I think that's. This is garbage. This is so useless. <laughs> um, uh, ammo. What ammo do we have in our thing at the moment? We have the table colors arrows. That's fine. Sights, all fine. After there's a. 
the doorbell's going off in my house, that's fine. Um, Atlo on 6, Red Deer on 9, Wild Boar on 0, Roe Deer on 8, I suppose. Uh, we don't... Do we need the night? No, we don't need the night I don't think they're helping us very much at the moment, are they? Yeah, um, make another lock of it. Yeah, that's fine. There's plenty of light enough to make other locks. Okie dokie. Uh, let's have a look at our missions. We've got Harvest 3 Rodia in Königsberg, I guess. Yeah, that's fine. That's story mission. As well as Vinay Bandry. Bandari, sorry, is a member of the European Bison Advisory Organization. His goal is the reintroduction of Bison to Europe. Um, we're looking for a carcass, that's fine. Harvest wildlife down to the scoped weapon from a. From a what? Uh, this is harvested deer at night, or we skip the night. Or we can go to Bonedorf and harvest the fox. Probably also requires the night, to be honest. So let's have a look at this. Schoenfeld Windmills. I feel like that's where we were going before. Yes, we've actually set up a <clears throat> tent here. So let's fast travel to the tent. Whack. Ah! Good, our tent has been destroyed. Marvellous news. What are we actually harvesting? Scoped weapon from a hunting stand. And we were gonna head to these and see uh, if either of these were hunting stands. Okay, our map is not doing so well at the moment. Now, there was an update uh, recently that I just finished downloading today, so it's possible that it might have reset all of our new sets again. That's what happened the last time. It does, it does look like we don't have any friends on that, doesn't it? God damn it. Okay, let's head over here and get on the road. <laughs> One is which which comes which in our inventory? One is the ranger, five is the magnet. Awesome. Ah around the rock. Not that rock, the other rock. <laughs> I saw some tracks in that area earlier this morning. Hold on, I'll send the coordinates. Earlier this morning, it's five o'clock. When were you out here earlier in the morning? And wasn't that night at that point? This is a bit of a steep bit. It's too steep of a steep bit. Well, we're always having a look when you see like an open patch like that.
my headphones are going slightly in the left ear, so my sound uh, perception might be a little bit off. It's not something I'm a huge fan of. These are nice enough headphones, and they've not been badly treated. Okay, we've got our first tracks. Looks like blood. And as soon as I didn't put it there, I'm assuming that it's a uh, need to. Until 4 30 a.m. I guess we, we shut it off in this direction. Well, actually, maybe this is where you came. Road here. What part of it? I think this is another. Go. Hard life down the scope weapon from ground blind or hunter accident. Wondering if there's a hunting stand over there. I'll be able to see. What the hell is that? That is a windmill. Unexpected. Right, there's been at least two foxes at this. Damn them. Heck no. If this is a hunting stand, you might be able to have this quest done pretty soon. It would be really nice if this hadn't bugged out. Um, um, well, this is the tower near a windmill, so I'm guessing this is the one it wants. Oh, there's actually a couple of windmills here. Okay. Why I'm not going to be able to see that guy over the crest of the hill. It's going to be awkward. Let's get here. No, you're going to be behind this, that's so annoying. Okay. Double check there's nobody else I can see. You get an excellent view here actually. Where's that one? That you? No, that's that. Where are you going to be most visible? Cack. Something right nearby. Am I not in my stand? Uh, 
Where are you? No, 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 no. Stay still. Cool. Okay. Right. Right, that's probably quest complete. Mail, oh dear, class, uh, color dot gray, class silver. Fantastic. Oh, there's two fellow deer down to the point two four three caliber rifle. It's fallow deer that I don't have a call for, isn't it? Oh, that wasn't so bad. I assume that was this deer. Looks like that's it. Well, that's a little bit of a shame. Only a little bit. Let's oh, head over to here. Oh, there's a fallow deer. Is the mission just do it anywhere? Two fallow deer, yeah, okay. Nothing I can do to call you, so I just gotta head in your direction and hope. If oh, lumberjacks in the background, in game lumberjacks, not real world lumberjacks. Um, they are the most annoying background sound. Oh gosh, possibly in any game. I think that was the fellow deer. Obviously saw me coming. Where did you go? I think I've got a quest for you. It's probably worth following. There's the fellow deer footprints. It's okay. We'll do a little bit of tracking. A little bit of tracking never hurt me. Or help the fellow deer footprints. I'll admit I'm surprised it didn't make any kind of noise. I wonder who these other tracks are. Another fellow. Okay, so you get a few of them.
head. Damn it. Oh, you had a nice weapon as well. Wait, what? Oh! I found the rabbit burrow. Huh. Well, the deer's definitely dead, because I got the follow-up shot on it, but it wasn't pretty. Um... I I I I caught him a second too late, just as he was about he broke into the run, um, which is a bit of a shame. No, I want this one. Thank you. The red deer call that sounds like someone passing that one. Well, he won't have got far. Yeah, non vital organ hit. Ah, oh, it's such a shame. He didn't get very far, did he? Why? Well, okay, we'll go pick him up in a second. This guy should be nearly done. Uh, and this place is, is a, a mess of hunting pressure now. Oh, there's a vest to me by there. There's our body. I will not expect anyone else to be nearby. Okay, given that no one else is here, fine. We'll do a little bit of that. Oh, I got the spine shot on the first one! Oh dear, and then that was much further back than I thought it was, actually. It would have been a gold. Ah, well. That's okay. I didn't check his... Skin colour, Egypt. Uh, dark, that's fine. Alright, we've got a rest spot here for someone. Road deer rest zone. Okay, now let's head over to where we shot that red deer. Oh, there's another fallow deer over there. It's quite far away though, because I didn't hear it at all. I thought I'll scan the general area just in case I spot him. I don't think we will though. He's probably further away than that. Well, this has been a productive day already so far. We're only. Oh, the S goes so it runs faster. We're only half an hour in, by me. Already three deer and one and a half missions down.
Well, that's not right there. You really didn't get far, did you? Oh, that fellow gets it's pretty far away. Forgive me for turning the mic off there. I had a rather sneezing fit, as one does. Uh, seeing as we are super close to that, I'm guessing I will pick that up and at least see what it is before uh, we move on. Oh my gosh, there's another one. Oh my god, he's a diamond. Where did he go? Don't move. Right, well, I really hope I haven't messed that one up. Silver red deer over here, marvellous. Run in this direction, super quick. I got him! Oh my god! <laughs> Diamond Red Deer! Wow, this really has been a pilot session! <laughs> okay, lumberjacks again. A wild boar warning call from over there. He didn't get far. Right, he has hidden himself in the trees. That's a vital organ shot. That's excellent, because I was a little bit worried. Oh my goodness, marvellous. You can't see him at all. Double lung. Perfect shot! Oh my goodness gracious! Wow! Uh, there we go! Lovely dear. Thank you for randomly wandering past. Um, taking a print screen of that to save. Um, <laughs> so I'm trying to get a good angle. Ah. Right, let's taxi down again. Wow. Very happy. Um, right. Yeah, we've uh we almost definitely exhausted this place. Um Wow. Okay, where do we have to go for, for missions? We've got Königsberg for this mission, which is just this whole area. So I could wander around here for a while. Uh and unlock some more things. So I've got to get, grab three roe deer in this area. Or we've got Rindle and Gorge. Oh, that's very far away. I could do worse things than heading over in that direction to try and get it unlocked. Uh, or 
What? Who's that? A pig? You? Oh, I don't want to kill you really because I've killed so many people right on top of this spot. I'm going to muck the zone. Even though you looked nice. Well, we'll let you live for now. I wish I'd seen you a second before I shot this deer. But never mind. It was a hot shot on the deer, but that's not so bad. Uh Right, what was I doing? Your uh place independence, Peter's Hain. Where's Peter's Hain? Peter's Hain is this bit. Okay. There's two lookout towers here. Or travel to Burndorf. Where's Burndorf? Oh, it's very far away as well. Okay, let's probably work on some of the further away ones. So I think a good starting point is probably, from where I am now, it's probably going to be to head to this house here. Um, that's probably a good place to journey to today. Um, well, it doesn't matter which one we have tracked, but we want this tracked because that's sort of eventually where we're going to be. Right. So this location here, pretty productive. Worth noting. I'm actually wondering if it's going to be worth putting up this hunting stand. Where is the hunting stand? Can't quite see here. And we'll build pass. Okay, I also like <laughs> was was not necessarily expecting um, that red deer just wandering right up to me. But I'm glad I managed to actually get the bow in. Normally when that happens, it's uh, it's a panic and a mess and it doesn't even work. But hey! Diamond red deer! It's not actually really much point in looking at animals for at least another few, maybe a hundred meters. Oh, okay, right. After that, that moment of excitement, back to the the chill walking sim bit of hunting of hunting simulator of Hunter Call of the Wild. Um, I know what game I'm playing, promise. Oh, is this new restaurant? Yes. What you are. Yeah. Could be a fallow deer. Oh. Are being particularly dark? Is it actually right in front of me? It's a wild boar. 
Come here, Pigu. You sounded right next to me, but I can't see you, but I... Where are you? Are you in that part of tall grass? Seriously, where is this pig? No, really, where's the pig? I feel like I'm right on top of it. Where are you? Oh my gosh, you're there. I didn't get him. Bother. Bother, bother, bother. I don't even know how close I was to get. To be honest with you. Is this a piggy rest spot? Piggy? Yeah, piggy resting spot. Active now. Sense. Oh yeah. Got him though. Marvelous. Just that. all the hunting pressure. Who's that? Oh, that's a piggy again. Hello, piggy. It's fine. Ah, oh, I spine shotted him. That was much higher up than I thought I'd hit him. Bella or her. Okay, right. Oh my gosh, Anna's a red fox. Uh, if there's a red fox, I need to swap out. Actually, these arrows do. Yeah, these arrows do cost two. They're around here somewhere. These are fox tracks. You run past already? Let's see where you went. No, those are boar tracks. Okay, go further up then. Where the fox there? Little foxy foxy. These are fox tracks. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's the lookout point in it. That's why you're ready. Little foxy monks in the other way past us by.
Don't excite me like that. These are board traps. The hell was that fox though? Oh my god, you scared the living daylights out of me. Absolutely terrified me. Although it's useful that the fox comes past us. I think there's a quest later on that is like shoot a fox from a, a lookout. I must get you, not in this terrain, I don't think. Even though I can hear you. Yeah, yeah. I think you went off this way. I think these are your tracks. I thought you might. Foxes are fixing their things. Let's hit the hitter. Oh my god. That's a fun idea. Okay, we'll head over to the fellow there, see if we can shoot you with a point two three. We need to be in a certain place for that. No, just anywhere. Oh, that's noisy in my ear. Ah, damn it. No, 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 ah, oh. too slow. That is not incidentally how you do it. But, I'll get the quest done. Straight through the back of the neck. Apparently that counts as a vital organ hit. Okay, that's alright then. Maybe that is how you do it. Uh, I mean, 25 meter scoop shot <laughs> feels like a, it's at least slightly unnecessary, but hey, it gets the quest on. Does it get the quest on? No. Why did that not get the quest on? Quest is how oh, there's two fallow deer down to the point two four three caliber rifle. Was I using the wrong gun? He takes me back to the last gun. No, I was using the right gun. I can't check my progress on that. Was it not a fallow deer? It was a fallow deer. Why didn't it count? What? Okay. Possibly quest bugged. My rain, my my rifle is a uh, yeah two four three two four three rude. I feel cheated. I've got all the hunting pressure as I don't need. Someone's nearby.
Not the... <laughs> I hit the rocks. Rocks hit rocks, I guess. God damn it. God damn you. Any of these need zone tracks? No, I don't think so. You've just been walking here a lot. Oh, I just put a bullet straight up into a rock at, at two meters range. Good job, Dizzy. Well done. Hmm. That doesn't say. That definitely doesn't say male phallic. It definitely doesn't specify a location. That's so weird. I could have sworn that was my second colour, yeah? Hmm. They're not super happy. This is a really nice area though. Like, hey, it looks pretty, but like, the amount of animals here. Huge. You know, just today we've seen, it just near this lookout tower, we've seen fallow deer, roe deer, boar, fox, and the red deer wasn't that far away even. The red deers were only over here. This place is hugely productive. This is a new zone. This who's so. Oh, we also found a rabbit burrow, which is our first ever rabbit burrow. We didn't find a rabbit, but we found a rabbit burrow. It does sound like I'm about to launch into some pheasant plucker esque. Tongue twister. I am not a pheasant plucker, but I am a pheasant plucker's son. If I were a pheasant plucker, I'd be a second generation pheasant plucker. That's not how it goes. Um. But it is true. Well, I mean, not the, the being the son of a pheasant plucker. That bit's not true. Well, I suppose my mother has once or twice plucked a pheasant. But I feel like to be a pheasant plucker involves more than just having plucked one pheasant. Wow, is that a road? A bridge? Oh, I don't know. It looks artificial. Let's go have a look. Let's go poke it with a stick. Uh, oh, there's some kind of field up ahead, I suppose, isn't there?
I've not really encountered many of these fields, but her shelter has lots of them. I think they're among the better shooting galleries, particularly for Cow of the Geese, which I admit I'm not enormously fussed by hunting. Tracks. Ah, that's probably what we saw earlier. It's the bombs and that. It's actually further away than it looked. I like this bush asset. I like the colour. Lovely rich orange. I love a good orange. Anything, really. I feel like I've lost which way I was going. Where, where, where was that? Well, where, where am I going? Oh, another new sign. Good to check that they're off. That's a fair idea. Yeah, fair idea. This is my best bet for calling a fellow dear. <laughs> it's just saying, here, fellow dear. Hmm. Oh, you smell this because you're. Oh, 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 I saw you. Oh, it's very well. They're off. Damn it. Oh, it was never going to be, was it? There's the bomb. The barn's not terribly far away from the house, actually. This is a roe deer feed spot. I wonder if that barn is this. No, this is near the barn. I should have checked what it is. It's only barn. Just to check what time it is in game. Eight thirty nine. See, they abandoned it a while ago. <laughs> That's okay. Every additional zone on the map, so I come back to later. If the game doesn't update and wipe them all away, and only if the game doesn't update and wipe them all away. They are still up there, aren't they? They are still down the river. I still don't think I have much chance of getting you. Keep my eyes peeled. Just in case.
Mm, this one. Come on, that's fair. Jesus. Now, for whatever reason, they seem to be moving sort of alongside me. So either you know, they're going to leave, or they're going to come out into the open over here and I'll be able to see them. They're not that fussed by a witch, to be honest. Shun felt stronger. Oh gosh, this place is so open. That's what we're heading towards. Wow. You can see so far, and yet there's still no animals. Um. I think that's one of the first times I've actually got a decent sight line that's gone up to the edge of render distance in this entire map. Hello. There's a fellow there. That might be a feed zone. Uh, I suppose we're getting towards that. I feel like I can. I assume it's just me moving, but it does sound like somebody's footstepping right next to me. Oh, there's a bunch of them. Including a male. Maybe it's just my gang. There's another one deep over there as well. Right, 190 meters. My hope is when I press this right, I'll be about 150 meters away. Which is obviously the same distance on my two four. I'm gonna double check. It definitely says Use a two four three caliber rifle. Number one is definitely a two four three caliber rifle. Right. So there's good news and bad news. This is we're a good distance away, bad news is sight line is not great. Um further up the hill. It's a bit better. Why are you all out on your own? You the the fellow there that no one likes. Oh, hey. There's a piglet over there. I want to go for it, but I don't want to scare off these deer. I don't want to miss the deer opportunity either. Because they are a quest.
Mama Piggy. Mama Piggy. Sound is real close. I feel like I might be to be honest. Okay, I don't see the old people. Oh, there's a piggy rest spot right up there. Bobba 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 bobba. Gotta go shoot the deer, gotta go shoot the deer. The rest spot can wait, I've got to go shoot the deer. What is that? Let's just see if I'm... Right, okay, the deer are still around. Oh, I'm making lots of noise now. Cack, oh, the downwind of me, that's not good. I really gotta get to a point where I can see this guy. Hell. Well, I hit him. Wherever this pig is, he wants to, to leave. Let's go grab the rest zone. Uh, he did go down. Hopefully. Hopefully. This will be our second one. Maybe the first one was a low deer instead? So he shot the wrong kind of deer at some point, possibly? Oh, feed zone here, hello. Oh. Are you still standing there? You are. There's a whole bunch of you together now. They're all females. Okay. Uh, I should have checked that. Is there any? Why did they go? Have I just completely lost them? Am I blind? Well, so all these questions and more might be yes. This is the same. So. Where the hell are you? I just saw you. There you are. Uh, 200 odd meters. That was only 100 odd meters. Right. Okay, you're dead. The waypoint where you came from. Let's, uh, I was about to say, let's go find you if you didn't go far. Make sure I've definitely got this mission tracked in case that was part of the problem. Confirm trophy. Silver. Male fallow deer. Marvelous. This mission is definitely for fallow deer. Oh, there's a comma. <laughs> there's a comma, but I can't see what comes after the comma. Oh, no. 
There's a Virgo over there as well. No, I would not mind at all. You came over here and I can harvest you with a bow. Although, actually, maybe this fellow over here. Oh no, I don't know what I need to do to get you because the cover's been cut off. Definitely can't get you. We're at 83 meters. That's definitely achievable. Where'd that red in go? How did that red disappear and enter? Oh, it was just it was hiding behind that tree. You are so nearly at a good range. I wanna get in this bush though. So I'm hidden from sight. It's so, okay, don't look at me, don't look at me, don't look at me. Someone oh, was right next to me then. What's that? That's a Canada goose! He's landed! I didn't think they did that! On their own. Oh, I can't see the deer. Can't see the deer. I know it's right next to me, but I can't see it. There. Oh. I think that's the noise of geese. I dread to think what they're doing to make that noise. But I think that noise is geese. Oh hell you know it. Alright, everyone heard that. Did I hit you at all? Yes, I did, and you and I killed you. Which is a little bit annoying. Alright, okay. Oh hell, I'll just run and scare him off. I'm not gonna hunt any of them anymore. I can't remember what the button is to whistle. Unlucky shot on the deer. Alright. Um, okay. Right, so can the geese come down now? Like, without you needing to put up decoys. That's good to know. And they do it here, which is a spot I was already considering camping. Right. right. I'm gonna mark that because I just heard a Canada goose mating. Now I actually can't remember what uh, what class they are. I'm wondering if I'm going to be able to bow hunt the goose. That would be something. Same fellow deer. It's, it's fair enough that they're warning calling. I have harvested two of their herds so far. And they were only saved from me harvesting a third by the appearance of a roe deer. Now 200 meters away from where I hit that deer. I want to see if I can bow hunt the goose, damn it. I'm assuming the goose has got to be class 1, right? 
Although that being said, the goose is definitely about the same size as the fox. Oh my god. Yes, they are class one. No, I want that. It's too, way too late now. 97 meters away he was by the time I finally got my bow out. <laughs> Blimey. Okay, well, okay. <laughs> so, uh, goose hunting less than successful so far. Must be said. But we know they land here. My OBS has a real paddy every time I can see, like, every time I have both OBS and, um, Pause the Wild open at the same time. And I mouse, and I, I tab back in to Pause the Wild, OBS has a right paddy and just stutters and jumps. And I, I have yet to figure out if that actually translates to something that you can see or not, but, like, it really bothers me. The only way to do it is to find out the exact timestamp in the video when it, when it happens. Um, you guys are so close. You guys should move further away. Because I'm not actually after you. I feel like I've got enough pressure in this area. I don't want to smash your zone by mistake. Maybe I should just run. I'll just go up and run. Run shoot. I should also figure out what the what the uh, the whistle button is actually. <sighs> keyboard key bindings. Whistle. I've got it set to slash. Because the default binding is X, but because I'm all fat thumbed, I can't reliably avoid hitting the X button. Oh, okay. I see. This is a need zone for you. I I hadn't realised you guys had need zones in quite the same way. By the way, you're 150 meters out. I don't think I can get a bow kill on using I guess the reason why you, you need zone here is because I can't approach from any direction. Where do we reckon this deer went after I shot it? Uh, It's a shame, because if I had my Viren, I reckon I could, could pop you 150 meters range. Um, where did this deer go? Hello? There's lots of tracks. But none of them are from the same deer. They're all from a different deal, also apologies if you saw the helicopter going overhead. I'd love to make them go away, but uh, it's not in, within my power or yours to do so. It's, it's going the wrong way. You ran this way, so you probably... Well, I mean, you were headed in this direction. So, that's where I would have gone if I were you. I would have kept going the same way I was already going. I hate this, where you, you, you get no tracks for a while after you shoot them. It's like the game knows. I hate 
this. Give me a track! Give me something with a directional marker on it, so at least know where to look. This is my least favourite minigame. Oh, hey, you're back. I don't know what the maximum uh, rating for you is, I'm guessing it's fine. It's good to know you exist. This other deer went in that direction. There, there we go, there's a track. A very well hidden one. But a track. Okay. Right. Oh my gosh, hello. Blimey. Kidding me, it's just a poop. No, there's blood. Okay, we know he's going this way. There's the next one. Ugh, okay. Alright, it might take us a while. But we will... We will, um... Get this here eventually. Then I guess we'll probably head over to this. I could try going by that. We'll try going by the goose food zone. So uh, they're, they're so hard to see. They're so small. It's partly is my fault for not shooting it well, but still. I like I like purple is the color I chose because it's the the best color, the most standout color. Uh, apart from maybe white, and I suppose I could if I'm having real trouble in the future, I could consider swapping the white and the purple to see if the white shows up better. <coughs> oh, excuse me, <sighs> a big stretch. And the problem is when you have areas of like dappled high contrast, some of the, the high contrast bits like this look quite white. Not always, but sometimes. Right, we got you in the leg. It was a, it was a total disaster from start to finish. Honestly. <clears throat> I was like, oh, I'll go hide in this bush. Oh, this bush has zero visibility. <laughs> like, pros can't be seen. Negatives can't see. Now, goose hunting is, is it's all supposed to be done a certain way. Like, you're supposed to set up a. Uh, a, a hell was that noise? You're supposed to set up a hide. Well, what do my big arrows cover? They're too big for a red deer. I think a red deer's cost six. That was not a deer clue. Just a lady deer?
got. He he paused for quite a while there after seeing me actually. I got that was a bit cheeky. You have very wonky outfits. Oh actually no, you don't, I just couldn't see the second bit. Silver deer, nice. Thank you very much. Right. I'm assuming your lady friend will have wandered off during that period. Well, that's interesting. No, there's no fallow deer anywhere in the range of that fallow deer call, is there? Okay, we'll see if we can sneak up on the geese. I'm not expecting to be able to, but we'll give it a go. We'll put on the small arrows. Oh, it's a little close. They're a little close, aren't they? And it's definitely arrows only. Hundred thirty meters, definitely. Both of hundred thirty meters. What I'd like to do is get around behind that tree, that one there. Do I think I'll succeed? No. Oh hell, especially not with this one. I could try going more slowly as I cross this open point. But it could take us a while. I might fly off while we're doing it. But we're going 100 meters off. So this is the, the point where we want to be quiet. Yeah, with this between us, hopefully they can't see it so well. I, I don't understand how they managed to mess this up because the missions used to work. Like the mission display used to work. <laughs> that that's never been broken before. So in trying to fix something else, they are constantly like adding stuff to this game, which is nice. But they are also constantly in the process breaking this game. They leave. Did they fly off? No, okay. Let's get down real low. I'll just crawl this last bit. Crawling across the road. Hope the car doesn't come and run me over. You know, as you do. We're going to be in a decent bow kill range. Well, I say decent bow kill range. We're going to be at the edge of bow kill range. Once we're in the tree. Okay. 50 meters distant now. Hold on. I'll give it a go. Oh my god, I got one. Uh, put these back. 
Dogs and Cats. Where's that fox then? He sounded close. He might have run away though. If he was close, he would have heard that. As in, he would have heard the bow shot. Obviously, he would have heard the collar. Ah, oh, there he is. Lost. And he's fleeing. Fleeing is definitely uh, not coming back, isn't it? Darn. Oh well, still, we got a goose. Oh, you're far enough away, I could risk it. Let's risk it for the best bit. Oh, he's moving. He's coming closer. That was a good shot on him as well. Right, our first ever goose. There's our foxy rocks in there. Oh, there's our foxy rocks in there. Oh, it's one now. I can't see him. Well, I see somewhere over there. But where? Somewhere in that bush. There. Don't think I got him. Oh, I did got him. Wow. Range find the bow is marvelous. Uh okay, no, I definitely didn't got him. Okay, I hit his knee. <laughs> Her knee, sorry. Okay, well still. A fox is a fox. Okay. Let's pick this up. And uh, head over to the house. Let's check out uptime. An hour 30. We're doing pretty well for an hour 30. Oh, there he's in again. And binoculars. Still getting textual problems. Um, which I'm not a huge fan about, but nothing I can do seems to particularly affect them. It's definitely not heat. My computer is not running anywhere near as hot as it was the last time I encountered those issues. So it's just a thing. Uh, I might actually go have a look at my farm, you know. That's an interesting part for me that just sort of ends. Yeah, I'll go have a look in the barn because they sometimes hide collectibles in the uh, Oh, I don't know what it's called. In in structures. I've also just thought, do we we do, we have a skill point. Now I have I've have all the skills that I sort of really want. Apart from Um There's tier three and tier four ambitious skills I don't think it's possible for me to get. You know, because I need to spend another thirteen points to unlock this. I don't think there's thirteen skill points left for me in the game. Uh, because the developers, among the many bad decisions that the developers have made, one of them is you can't unlock enough skill points to get everything. I mean, it's not necessarily a bad decision, but like, it's not something I'm particularly fond of in this particular case. 
Um, so this one I've been considering, uh, increased chance of listening vocalization from animals. I don't care about that. That's interesting. That you can spot animals while in, in zoom mode. That's definitely interesting. Hello, Lionel. Oh hell, I didn't actually need to shoot that. Whoops. Well, we've got one arrow left of this type. Um, I was just trying to hit E um, to, to range find. Yeah, so spotting animals, interesting option, possibility. This I'm also curious about. This, you know, this one, yeah, don't care. This, don't care. I don't ever use lures. Stalker, got you. This, don't really care. Hang on, let's grab you. About the fallow deer. The name fallow is derived from deer's pale brown colour. You mill a whole stone just to tell me that? I mean, I love the, the little lore entries, but uh, I want more lore, not less. Oh, and it's raining again. Uh, yeah, so skills. Don't care. Um, weather prediction, I don't care, like the weather, like it's not like it allows me to control the weather, so who cares if I know it in advance. This one's interesting, it further decreases your visibility inside large bushes and shrubs, that might be useful. Don't care about that so much. Wind prediction, again I don't care. Startle call, <sighs> might be interesting. Might be interesting, but it's an active skill, which I would probably, like, I'd have to know that I want to use a Startle Claw. Because my default active skill is the, uh, oh, you can't see it at the moment, but it's the, 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 the range changer, the zero range changer down there. So that one's interesting. That one's interesting. And then level two of that is interesting and that one well like that's definitely useful that's definitely useful that one's interesting but might not be useful and that one's interesting but like it's definitely a, a straight upgrade but i feel like if i had that it might be a deterrent to using the binoculars at all which i don't really want but sometimes i definitely really do want to be able to spot in in weapon modes i can't remember how many I can't remember how many skill points you get in total. I could look that up. So I've spent 20 in total. I've got one here. Let's look it up. How many skill points? You get 22 skill points and per. So I spent 20, I have one free. That means I have this one skill point. Like, so that's dead handy. That one's often quite useful because anything that lets me have more tracking is pretty useful. Uh. There's nothing I would really change. <sighs> so I've got to choose. I've got to choose two out of one, two, three, four. That one's good because it stops animals from spooking. That one's good because it helps me find out. That one, there's nothing I can't, I can do with that now that I can't do. And then there is something with that that I can't do now. I think I'm probably going to pick up this. Oh, that decreases visibility. 
and then I'll I'll pick, probably pick up this with my last skill point. Um, so that I can find the animals more easily. The startle call is definitely interesting, but like I don't think I can use it in that style. Well, this place is actually pretty wrecked. Which I have as well. Uh, it is also pretty empty, which is a shame. Can I go up the stairs, do you reckon? Oh, I can. Oh my gosh, there's a rabbit bug. As if this place didn't have enough, it's also got rabbits. Well, that's good to know. Can I interact to get down, or is it just a fall off? It's fall off. Okay, uh, what am I got? Yeah, no collectibles, just a little bit on. But, we found more rabbits. Let's piece it there. And there's a little sign there. Probably says something in German, but I won't read. There's such a lot of hungry pressure here. There's no hungry pressure like anywhere on the map apart from where we've today, basically. Also, it's really interesting this pattern of how it's gone from here. Like, it's just cut off in a in a square line. That's so bizarre. I don't know why it does just end. How oh. odd. Schoenfeldt's German Feld. I guess that probably means Schoenfeldt's Raw Fields. Schoenfeldt Vorpost, and that probably means Schoenfeldt Outpost. I speak German, I don't speak German. I was told when I was young that German would be a very important skill for someone who wanted to go into paleontology. I was told, you know, oh well, there's lots of paleontology pieces that are written in German. It's not true. It's not, it might have been true, you know, 50 to 100 years ago, perhaps. But it's just not true. You don't get scientific papers really published in languages other than English and maybe um, whichever one of the Chinese languages is most popular. I think it's what I'm doing, but I don't know. You know, like if you're a European scientist, you publish in English. I was also told that Latin would be useful for sort of a similarish reason. Again, totally useless. Totally, totally useless. <laughs> So I, I, I opened up my Twitch stream manager to see like what the stream looks like. And it goes super duper smooth for the first like second or so. And then it catches up to the point where I'd opened up the Twitch stream manager and it goes super duper jerky and stuttery, like four frames per second. And I don't understand because I don't feel like I have that problem with any other game. I don't feel like having both Sniper Elite open and OBS streaming cycling. I don't feel like that stutters my stream the same way. Yeah, you know, PHK occasionally uh, tanks anyway. But like, 
you know, like, I don't think it's affected by the fact that I have OPS looking, open looking at it. I don't know why Hunter is unique like that. It has this unique problem. Ugh. <sighs> well. Wow. I've just realised, this whole square we've not actually set foot in at all. We have set one little foot, tiny foot, over here in Ernsdorf. I don't know why, but we have. We've just about crossed this river here. Um, yeah, we've never, we've never been in this area. So that will be interesting and exciting. And as a reminder, our eventual goal is Gwendolyn Gorge, which is over in the very furthest area region. So from here, theoretically, we want to head to that. Uh, let's pick up this. We'll pick up that as we are so close to ending. It's presumably on the hunting side. I'll grab this first. This. It's a ladder? Question mark? With that on top? Could be a very, very large artist's easel. It's an artist's easel for lots of artists of different heights to work at at once. So like me at crouch height, I work at this one. And then me at standing height, I work at this one. And then there's someone on the soapbox behind me at that one. Um, Tickenau Lake. Okay, let's claim. Outpost. Wait, Tickenau Lake? Are we near a lake? Oh, we're near the lake that, that's between us and Ernstorf, I think. So, okay, yeah, we're near this lake. Turn off. We could actually, if we're getting down this way anyway, we could head over this way and start working towards this lookout point, see if there's anyone chilling around the edges of the lake. That could be a, 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 a place to head next. Let's pop a waypoint tower over that way. I can actually see the lake from here. This. I wonder why their signs have little shelters. What is the what is the purpose of that? Also interesting, this hunting stand here, which is super duper close to the fast travel point. Of course, if you wanted to fast travel there, you would then scare away anyone that this hunting stand could actually see. Daft. Utterly daft. I thought as soon as there is a hunting stand here, as soon as I didn't pass by here, I'd have a nosy on over just in case there was anybody around. That's all right. Let's just realize, I guess this goose speed zone must have times. Yeah. Okay, interesting. I wonder if that reflects a more total overhaul of how the chemical police work. I wonder if they work more like regular animals now. And that they're like sort of persistent. I wanted the animal left, but I wanted to see what this open area has for us. Oh my gosh, what this open area has for us is another house. Hello, and a well. I wasn't expecting to see you. He's hiding behind the bush there, another house, sure. We can have a look. Uh, doesn't look like we'll be able to get in. We can have a poke around at least. Yep, wherever that is, that's out of the window. Is that an island in the middle? I don't actually look. No, I guess that must be this shore.
on Earl Jets, uh, Earl Jets camp. Okay. So we call the Earl Jet this here. <laughs> I can't say I've ever encountered the name Earl Jet before, but then I have encountered lots of Jet names before. You got anything for us in your cabin, Earl Jet? Uh, you've got the track. By, which actually, I feel like I haven't seen any tracks since I left the, the straw fields. Or indeed any other trace of our life, really. That's good. I wonder who it is. Can I get any at all? Nope. Uh, simple cabin. Doesn't seem to be any collectibles there, by. More traps under there, they're not neater. But there's just really good traps. Nothing there on the back. That's okay. Who was this? Uh, this was a fellow there. Okay. Well, the fellow there that we have to shoot with a .243 rifle while doing something else. But that something else could be anything from like being in a hunting stand to being over a certain distance to while hopping up and down on one leg and wearing a clown nose. I'm confident I couldn't play this game while hopping up and down one leg, with or without a clown nose, but uh, you never know. What what comes after the comma is a mystery. Oh, excuse me. Sleepy, sleepy, busy. This game always makes me very tired. I think it's just because it's quite calming. Like, even the bits where you're like, oh, be stealthy, stealthy, there's someone nearby. Like, they're tense moments, but they're not, like, high action moments. And then you get the kind of the, the tension come down. That must be nice. Yeah, that's Actually, let's go have a look at the island. See if there's a way across to the islands. I'm guessing there won't be, but uh, let, we'll, we can have a look at this. Also, see how old this track that we've been sort of accidentally following is. It's probably pretty old. Very old. <laughs> Doesn't look like there's been. Oh no, there's a bridge! Okay, there's a bridge across to the island. I mean, that's potentially useful in and of itself, because that makes the island uh, a natural choke point. <laughs> like any animal that goes onto the island can't really get off. Play, play what? Red deer. So that's a grey deer then. Um, sorry. I wonder if there'll be something on the island. Oh, it called you. There you are. Look how many I am. Must be down here somewhere. Just gotta figure out. Oh, there you are. 
Hold on. Too late. Well, I'm pretty sure I shot them from close by, so it's not going to be from within 50 to 25 meters. My guess is it's going to be from a certain distance. What's the, the, the side text? Take up some speed. Maybe you have to down them within a certain amount of time of each other? That'd be an, an interesting twist, I suppose. There was a fellow deer around here. I spooked it. Stuff fire. I don't like it. One of the things Disney hates more than most of the IRL stuff fire around their face. Alright, well. Ah, we have now technically been to this area, which is called. Oh, no, so we still, have, we still haven't figured out that we've been to this area, that's okay. Yeah, it's wrong that way. Like, it could be at night, it could be all sorts of things. To spend the rest of eternity blasting fallow gear with a 243 rifle until I have to stumble upon the correct set of conditions twice. Um, yeah, the sort of ultimate goal is this, but I don't think we're going to get there today. So, what I might actually do is, is have a fire export again. Uh, off stream, I'll come back and, and drive a quad bike over to that point with a tent on the back. Put the tent down, and then we, we might pick up from there next session. But I mean, wow, such a such a productive day! <laughs> such a productive day. Not another island. Yeah, that's another island. We may or may not need to get onto. Oh, it could be while using iron sights. What the hell? There's just a uh, a floating pole. As one does. Um. <laughs> Fix your game, devs! Fix your game! What is this? What's that? I mean, yeah, there's holes in the terrain. Okay, those can't always be avoided. But, like, come on! It's a, I don't mind when it's like a, 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 the occasional bit of grass or rock is floating like a couple of meters above the ground. But what's that, huh? What's that? I suppose maybe that's, a, maybe that's attached to a bridge that hasn't rendered in yet? That's a possibility? Oy vey. Fix your got darn game. Oh, that deer did come this way. I'm guessing he's long gone. That makes sense. But uh, he did come this way. We're also going a little bit um, into the wind. No, with the wind. Which is not ideal. So maybe when I get down to this island, I'll. Uh, I mostly want to go down to the island to see if there is actually a bridge there, but it hasn't been for me. But uh, 
Yeah, maybe when I get down to the island, I'll call it there for this bit. I'll see what our uptime is. Uh, we're about two hours. That's probably enough for us, uh, a single stream. So when I get down to the island, I'll call it there. When we come back, if the wind's still um, not in our favour, then we'll head off somewhere else. While I'm off stream, I might also look up what I actually have to do for this quest. <laughs> um, given that, you know... Uh, it's hidden behind a comma. And it, it would be fine if this works. Or if this works. Like, there are plenty of ways that it could work. It's just that it doesn't for any of them. That definitely looks like there's supposed to be a bridge there. Oh, well, actually, would you put that pole on the bridge? That looks like a, a walking route kind of pole. And there's no path here. But uh, there's no path to the other bridge. Hmm. Hmm. I can't believe that. Honestly, honestly, what is this? For goodness sake. If the ears are not rendered that much, then I'd be almost on top of it here. And this doesn't look like a landing area full of bridge, like it's all with trees and high ones. Plus, that signpost is actually... it's not quite lined up properly. I just... like there are some things that you can't help as a game. If you can't help holes in the terrain always. You can't help if an animal judges. And sometimes you can't help the kind of slightly wonky graphical glitches like that over there. But this is just a floating asset in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> That's It's such an easy win to take that out and be like, yes, I've done something to fix the game. Uh, I, love, I love the game. It's a beautiful game. I've had a blast playing it today, but that just every time I play, it's just like there's something that makes me go like, oh for goodness sake, guy. Shall we finish off with a bison hunt? There's, uh, there's a male. Oh, you're at 400 meters distant, though. You're pretty far away. Right. Okay, well, we'll do what we can. What's the maximum range on this? 300 meters. We can give it a go. I mean, I don't honestly think this has the penetrative power to, to kill a bison in one shot from 300 meters. You know, if I was using the King DB at max zeroing, then that's different because that's a class 9 only gun. But this is a 4 to 9. This is a it will technically get the job done on a nine. No more, no less. There is a big disagreement between my marker, that's supposed to be on top of, if not slightly overshooting this bison, and this and this bison. Oh, he's moved behind his friend. Don't do that. Don't do that. I know you like your friend, and I know your friend likes you, but don't use them as a, as a, I was about to say a healing shield. Don't use them as a bison shield. Bison shield sounds a lot less bad than a human shield, but for a bison, it's actually just as bad as a human shield for a human, I promise. Bison actually have a very complicated system of ethics. Um,
I was trying to come up with a bison related pun for the Geneva Convention as well, but I know. But it wasn't happening. Oh, there's actually one more of you. You are in such an annoying position. You really are. A horrible thing. Oh my god, hello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. No, there's another one over there. What are you? Yep. Yep. Ow! Oh god, leave me alone. Oh god, there's a lot of you. Oh god, there's really a lot of you. Oh boy. Yep. That's two. brown bison. I don't know if he's going to go down. Um, wow, that one went right through him. Jesus. That one also went right through him, but somehow managed to miss everything of interest. Uh, okay. Well, they're still there, actually. have exactly zero way of figuring out if this guy's died. Um, unless I can find some blood. Am I even tracking the right one? Wound severity unknown. I think I hit him. Fairly confident I did hit him. But uh Beyond that, who knows? There's blood. No one can see it. He's probably not gone down then. At 200 meters distance. One of you is a male. Can't bloody find out which one it is. We'll assume he probably hasn't gone down. Not you, not you. Is it one right at the back? There's the blood. We went very low. Not expecting anything. I'd like to put another arrow in him to finish him off. But do I want that more? Uh, 200 meters. I don't even know how I'd hit you. Do I have a bison call? I don't think I have a bison call. Why does he look like you have a glowy arrow when you do?
Nope. Move your head, please. Well, I hit him. I'm not expecting anything, but I hit him. Oh, here he comes! Not the list. Come back here. Such long travel time. Got him. Not a non vital hit, though. What's his health at? 25% or, well, 50% or less. That might be enough. The rate was still very low, which is not ideal. Go faster than him while running. Sort of thought that I might be able to, given yeah, that he does now have two eggs in him. He might go down. He's below 25% now. Poor one and poor. Dyson. Where was that track? This way. There we go. Went down. Did this one go down? Doesn't look like it, does it? Okay, first one sadly was a little bit low, and the second one, because I was trying to lead the shot, actually nearly was a headshot. Um, would have been alright, but never mind, eh? Okay. Let's head back over this way. There's a slight chance that he may actually turn to where he wants. I wouldn't bet on it, but it's a possibility. But I want to see at the very least. Oh dear. Not too much. I was not even planning to honestly be around this long, but uh, <laughs> we happened to stumble upon two separate groups of bison. Uh, yeah, I'll go have a look at his blood trail. If his blood trail looks promising, or if he's still there and I can shoot him again, then uh, we'll give a go at tracking him down. But my guess is we're actually going to leave him like that, which I, I don't want to do. Exactly, but uh, you know, we, we gotta wrap it up at some point. I can't keep playing this forever. And the game does make me so sleepy. <laughs> so, so sleepy. Uh, tomorrow will be more prehistoric kingdom, I should think. Um, I did a little bit of, of messing around off stream. Oh, hello. There's a different male. We could try and take you, couldn't we?
Oh hell. I used the wrong bullet. He's definitely not going down. He might. Uh, uh oh. That was a good hit. That was actually two good hits. This bison is definitely going down. There we go. I hope this wasn't the one I also shot. Actually, I kind of do. Yeah, it was the one I also shot. Oh, the first shot was actually an alright shot. I just used the wrong ammo. That's a shame. Uh, yeah. You also damaged... Oh. I got him in his head there. Yeah, I did, didn't I? That's a shame. Oh well. I like the other guy definitely didn't go down. I'm gonna have a look at um, where he was, just in, on the off chance that he's come back. But I think even if he had come back now that I fired off a gun, he would probably have gone again. Ah! If I'd used the right ammo, that actually would have been a great, a great kill. It's just a real shame. A real shame. My guess is, I think it's something like, oh, I did figure out what the, oh, I say figure out, I did learn what the distance was that animals won't spook if they hear a shot from. I think it's like 300 meters. So I think if they're, they, even if they had come back, they will now have spooked again. And we can see there's no hunting pressure, so he definitely didn't splat. This is a big shame, but... It's not the end of the world. There's little foxy tracks. Fox doing a trot. That's why they call it the fox trot. I was actually happy when I saw that, that group coming at me just then. I was like, oh, well, maybe this is the same group. How long is that a tree trunk? I think that's a tree trunk. I don't think they're back. Oh well. It's interesting there's a lot of bison around here. It's three separate groups we can get it. Okay. They're all stood somewhere around here. Have a look, see if we can find a blood trail. See how much damage we did with that shot. Oops. Okay. Why do we think they were stuffed? That looks like blood. Now oh, that's the hit. Very old. I don't have any high expectations of finding him. He's definitely not going down. Okay, well, we'll call it there then. Um, so, uh, firstly, uh, thank you everyone very much for watching. Uh, if you have enjoyed watching Call of the Wild, uh, or me in general, <laughs> uh, then do please consider leaving a follow if you're watching this with me on Twitch, uh, or if you're watching on YouTube as a VOD later. Uh, do please consider dropping a like or even subscribing if you want to see more content like this. Uh, my YouTube has all of my old bods from uh, you know, Call of the Wild dating back many months, I should imagine at this point. 
Prehistoric Kingdom that I've been playing recently, uh, Stray that I've been playing and I think I'm fairly close to finishing on as well. Uh, or alternatively, uh, you can follow me on Twitter at this for demise, no underscore there. Uh, and I send out the tweet every time I go live, so you never have to miss one of these as they happen in the future. Other than that, my name has been Disney. Thank you everyone once again very much for watching, and I will see you all next time. Ta-ra!